Hi children, welcome to Eclid Learning. So uh, this is the second video for grade seven workbook. So if you haven't watched my previous uh, videos for grade seven textbook, there's a separate playlist for that. Please watch them first and study this uh, chapter first and then please try these exercises yourself. Okay, then you can come back and uh, check these answers whether they are correct or not. Please do not copy the answers straight away from the video and just uh, uh, submit it uh, to your school or something like that, because then uh, you won't get the real uh, value from that, right? Okay, so let's start. Operating system. So in the first activity, they're asking, list five tasks performed by the operating system so operating system is doing so many tasks right it's a must to have in a computer to operate so it controls hardware and software right it provides an user interface where our user can interact with the computer right and it uh, controls the functions of the central processing unit not only that all the hardware and software is managed by operating system and uh, operating system manages the computer memory uh, and the operating system is the one which do the storage management. It's the one which do the file management. It's the one who do the security related management, network related management. So operating system is actually performing so many tasks uh, in the computer. So in the next one, they're asking you to match the following operating systems with its uh, commercial uh, logo. So here it's very easy because the logo itself has the name. So you can easily pick this. So this is the Windows, Microsoft Windows logo. This is the Microsoft DOS. Remember this was the early used operating systems where command line interfaces are there. And this is Ubuntu, this is Fedora, these three are mobile uh, related uh, operating systems, Android, iOS, OS, or the Apple Macintosh operating system. This one is BlackBerry OS. So in here, they have given you some uh, pictures or some images for a computer screen of Ubuntu operating system. So you can see the differences computer screen of the iOS operating system, computer screen of BlackBerry operating system, computer screen of Fedora operating system, computer screen of uh, Windows operating system. So I have uh, discussed these things in the uh, textbook video also. So this is a computer screen of the Mac operating system. This is the computer screen of Android operating system. Okay. So in that, uh, nothing uh, to do, but just to uh, refer them and get an understanding how these user interfaces are different from operating system to operating system. So in actually 2.2, they are talking about storage devices. What are computer storage devices? So storage devices are devices which are used to store data information and programs of the computer. So what are the things we can store in uh, computer storage devices? You can store data, information or programs. So data can data and information can be like movie file, can be something uh, like word processing of uh, word processing document, spreadsheet file, or it can be a PowerPoint presentation, it can be an image, right? The same lens, it can be programs, like it can be system uh, software or application software. So operating system can be saved. You can save any application softwares like web browsers, games, word processing software itself. So all these things are stored using uh, computer storage devices. The third question they're asking, magnetic media devices, optical media devices, solid state media devices. So are the three categories of computer storage devices. So above categorization is based on which factor, right? It's based on their manufacturing technology. Understood? So how these uh, devices are uh, implemented or the manufactured 
is uh, used for this cl classification or the cl categorization. In the fourth question, consider the following storage devices. So they have given six devices and they're asking you to correctly insert the above devices into the below table or the following table. So in the first one, it's about magnetic media devices. So hard disk, external hard disk, uh, and magnetic tape and zip, right? All these things belongs to magnetic media devices. And for optical media devices, right? You can put CD and DVD. For solid state media devices, there are no devices from this list, right? Okay. In activity 2.3, List files and folders separately in the computer screen shown in the following diagram. So here they have given some picture and they're asking you to separate files and folders. So what do you mean by folders? These yellow color things will be folders. There are three things, school images, scan document, and science day video. So this one is a bit confused, right? Uh, it's It looks like a folder, but actually can you see the white background here? This is actually a kind of an image, isn't it? So um, agenda, classroom, sheet one, and office budget, consider this as an image, right, with the white background there, uh, where the classroom and this one both are like images. So there are four files to be shown here. So files are office budget, agenda, sheet one, classroom. And under folder, school images, scan documents, and science day videos can be put. Uh, please note these spellings is wrong because here I have copied the same thing because uh, that's what they have given. So this maybe we can consider the user has uh, put it wrong. So don't go and correct it because that's what it is shown in the user interface. Activity 2.4, consider the following files and write them under the suitable folder to store. So there are a few uh, files and you have to uh, categorize them to suitable folders. We'll see what are the folders we have. Term test, songs, drama video, and MS Word. Okay, so first one, term test mark list of students in a class. So definitely it's about term test mark so we can put it to this folder term test folder and then a video for the school drama which participated in all island uh, drama competition so it's about videos right and here we have something called drama video we can definitely put it there and next one is agenda of sport meet right You'll see anything matching? Yeah, MS Word folder we can use, right? Because uh, usually agenda we prepare using um, Microsoft Word processing software. So for that time we can put national anthem. Yeah, it's a song. If you consider it as a song, we can put it under songs folder and a picture of the sport meet. So nothing match for that, right? Because there's no for images folder or sport meet related one or for school related one. So I cannot put that under any folder. So I will just keep it. Okay. So that's the end of chapter two. These are very uh, small uh, video clips uh, where I will be talking about all the workbook activities. So if you haven't see, uh, still subscribed my channel, uh, please do subscribe. And uh, if you haven't uh, pressed my bell notification, please uh, uh, press that and keep it because then all the notifications will be received for you. And please do comment. If you learn something, if you appreciate my work or if uh, I need to improve something, all the comments are welcomed. So um, thank you very much.